now. I'm not, I'm not trying to copyright anybody. I just like heavy metal. Puts me in the right mood to live. So, Kurt's better at doing this stuff, so I probably won't talk about this whole thing. Just so you know. I'll try to describe what I'm doing, but it's more of a video about the time. Uh, but foam rolling, getting a little loose. And I'll give you my dynamic warm up, get you into the swing of things. Now time for dynamic stretching. Alright, so we're on the far side of the gym now. Got my favorite squat wrap. I'm going to take you through one of my uh, heavy days on squats. Skip a few warm up sets for you. So, as you can see, my warm up is fairly lengthy. I try to get nice and warmed up before I get going. You want to do that to kind of save your joints a little bit of hassle. And doesn't make any sense to throw heavy weight right on the bar right away, so. And then, now we're just gonna work some heavy singles. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up for these. Because I'm working a lot, I can't afford any injuries. I use this body for more than just lifting weights, unfortunately. More often than not, I don't wrap my wraps too tight, just a little bit of extra support. Yeah, we're going to see if we can get up to a heavy single about 455 today. Whether that happens or not, we'll drop it down for doubles and we'll see how it goes. Feel pretty good today though. Not too bad, a little slow. 
still warmed up. I still need a little bit more, I think. Boy, I hope the depth of that was good. It's always the big thing when you're squatting heavy weights is you don't know how low you are until you see it on video. So hopefully that was deep enough. Felt good. Probably need to go a little deeper. When in doubt, always go two inches more. All right, so here we got 455 on the bar. I may have to bail on this one, I'm not gonna lie, my lower back's feeling a little tight. That last one was a little, a little high for my liking, but we're gonna give it a shot anyway. And if I have to bail, we have to bail. And it's just like that. So 455 is not in the cards today. Try it once. I'm not gonna get up. Be honest, I don't feel like I'm very aggressive right now. Might be because I'm on camera. I don't know. It's Kurt's idea. Thanks, Kurt, for doing my squat workout. Just kidding. So we'll lighten her up, see how the rest of the lift goes. Alright, so we lighten the bar up to 405. We're gonna see if we can get some doubles out of this. Get back my range down to the bottom. That should be better. A little grindy there on the second one, not too bad. Alright, here we go. 405, round two. Let's try to make that one a little faster than the last one, right? Overall, a little smoother. Got one more set. All right, round three. Alright, so if we're going to uh, dead heavy deads, the back's just not feeling it today, so we're going to substitute power, which means there's a power exercise in there. Hopefully it'll give me enough quickness. I realize my power clean from sucks, but it's worked with me on this, alright? See how the rest of this goes.
All right, we're up to a good uh, working set here. I'm gonna build up my back feeling kind of crappy right now, so let's see how this goes. Slippage, not bad. And what good leg workout wouldn't have some single leg and stuff? Do some heavy split squats. Here's a little twist on your traditional split squat. Adding some bands to the mix. I hadn't tried this one until today, so Merry Christmas. Just a little wet. So after another couple sets of those last exercises, another app. Now it's on to conditioning where we're going to do some prowler. A little bit of light farm carries work on my grip strength. Um, burn through it. That's pretty much a workout. I'll let you see one set of this and then color good day. There you have it. Max effort squat day for Jess. Hope to see you next time. Check out our Facebook page, hostileconditioning.ca. And we love the lift. We hope you do too. Out. Okay.